What's going on, Creepers? My name is Jay. Jay Xane, and welcome back to Crundy Craft. When we last left off, we uh, actually got all the pets sorted out, and we also got uh, this all sorted out. I believe I haven't actually. It's been a while since I've actually recorded this, so it's kind of kind of difficult, actually. It's about canaries. Oh my god. Mo, when we last left off, we actually um, I'm not sure if it was in the. Uh, in this, but I believe that we did have a mod in here called the Easy Crafting mod, where basically it allows me to um, um, like just open up the GUI and then whatever items I have go into here and automatically craft the actual items themselves. But I ended up taking that out because it was glitching out with uh, some other mods that were installed in the pack, like the regular pack itself. However, I did actually install... There's the... Uh, all right, did we? Did we? I don't remember. Did we actually mine home? Huh. All right. Well, whatever. I thought we uh, went to the end. I can't remember though. I should probably refer back to that video. But uh, yeah, uh, I did end up going around and uh, looking for some other mods to install on here, just so that we have something a little more organized just to say the least um which is basically one of the mods of course because i don't like doing the whole teleport back and forth between like the mines and the uh the home and things like that uh, i did install a mod i did install actual uh did install an actual mod there uh called the tf2 tele teleporty teleporty yay uh, TF2 teleporter mod, which I'm going to make uh, one, uh, two sets of these um, today so that we can have something to like go to the mine with and then go back to here, etc, etc. And then I also installed a mod that you'll find interesting that you may have seen uh, some information about here. But uh, yeah, it's I didn't install that specific mod, but it is uh, similar to that. It's called the the equivalent exchange mod, uh, if I can type. Um, Project E is actually the a remake of equivalent exchange two. Uh, this is equivalent exchange three, which I find a lot more useful, or a lot u more useful and a lot more balanced than the equivalent exchange two mod, uh, or E two for short, uh, because you're using the resource to make the items, but you're also using um, basically. Equivalent, ex like equivalent exchange values. Um, now, I will be looking into possibly getting the configuration set up so that things like craftable items, like that, the torch, uh, torch should be, should have an equivalent exchange. And there go sticky keys. Um, basically, it should have the, like the the base Minecraft item should have all of the equivalent exchange values to them, but it doesn't. So during this uh, during this playthrough here today, I'm gonna be crafting the um, first. I'm gonna be crafting the TF2 teleporters because I want to make sure that they's, those are all set and done. And then the next episode, we'll work on the equivalent exchange. RIP. Um, because the equivalent exchange itself could take an episode in itself because I don't know if I have all the resources. But uh, that being said, we'll jump right on into it and get this all sorted out. So let's go start get started on getting get out. Um, getting the resources here for the TF2 teleporters. Uh, so first and foremost, what we're gonna need is the base and the propeller. The propeller takes um, basically a similar uh, similar to that of the comparator, I believe, um, or Repeater. Repeater, I think. Yeah, yeah, repeater. I think it was repeater. Um, redstone, redstone torches, and iron. And I have a bunch of redstone. Uh, t -t 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 I had iron. Where's the iron at? I have some iron here. Ah, uh, there it is. <laughs> I knew I had iron somewhere. Uh, and redstone torches, which I need sticks for. So let's get that out here. Now, just to clarify, my, I know my chests aren't that organized, but uh, there goes my phone. Um, 
I have no idea why I went to the crafting bench for this. Also, I don't know why I didn't just do that. Uh, I have no idea. I'm blanking out right now. Um, so there's that. I have the resource for that, and I also have this. So what I'm going to need is I need two of these and two of these. Uh, so I'm going to need a total of six. No, uh, no, I need 12 plus another... 28 iron yeah so I need about 40 iron right then and there so we'll get that started here one two three four oh right they don't stack I forgot about that it's been a while since I've actually played this mod for obvious reasons um, and I also need one two three four five six seven eight wait how many do I need uh, two per, which means I need, yeah, I need eight. All right, I need eight torches, plus on top of that, I'm going to need to make the base here. So, oh, rusty ladder, okay then. All right, um, uh, where's the torch? There we go. Oh, if I could click properly, that would be great. All right, so there's that, um. All right, so we got the re base resources out. Um, now, before we can be, uh, continue, uh, we also need colors for each of the matching individual parts. So I need two blue and two red, which is the uh, two lapis and, or, what was it? Yeah, yeah, so I need two lapis and two uh, rose red dyes. Uh, just, just, just gonna put these back. In my other series, I have a bunch of fucking draconium dust that I have to... Or that I have in my inventory. I don't know what to do with it yet. I have to actually look into that. Um, so now I need to sleep because fuck you. I don't want to deal with the nighttime here. Let's do this. All right. Uh, t -t -t blue. Two of these, and I'm also gonna need if I have the roses. I probably don't. Um. That would work, possibly. I don't know. Yeah, okay. There we go. And then we would just do the propeller, the base, and that. And we got ourselves the first one. And the same thing again. Of course, they don't stack, though. So we'll do that, that, and that. And that. Alright, so we got the first one done. I'm actually going to put one... I, what I'm going to do in this episode as well, since it's not that long of an episode so far, I'm also going to actually, I'm going to put these away here for now, just so that I have the inventory room. Uh, I'm also going to work on a small little base below. Um, so where should I put... I feel like something's missing there. I'm going to have to go back into the video and look, because I think, I think I'm missing a chest. Huh. Enderman. I blame Alex. Um, now, what I'm thinking of doing was creating a multi-level base, but um, when the time comes, because I know that there's also, uh, I think it's Ender.io in this. Um, where is it? 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 Basically, there's a block in one of the mods here. I think it's, uh... Well, one of these blocks, I have to look into it um, on my own time there. But basically, one of the blocks allows you to uh, jump from floor to floor with... Uh, or actually, jump from panel to panel. Uh, like a teleporter of some sort. I just can't remember what the actual... Unless, yeah, this lays in place. Um, I don't know what that happened. Okay, whatever. Actually, no, I didn't think so. I wouldn't have done it anyways, but it was a, worth a look. Uh, transports, items, art. Um, no, that's not it, but I'll keep that in mind as well. Uh, vacuum chest. I will, uh, 
definitely look into that as well. Pressure on fluid tank. Fluid tank. I know. Killer Joe, what the hell? Attacks nearby creatures with a supplied sword and treat insulation. Experience can be strained as liquid XP is his fluid conducts. Nice. Um. I'll take a look to see what, which one it is because I know that there's one in here that allows you to. Um. Basically, that allows you to teleport from one to the next. Um. I have no idea, actually. You guys need to just cut that shit out. Um, yeah, I don't know yet. I'll have to take a look into it once I get to that point. But um, there is there is some sort of like teleporter, I believe, in this, uh, the Ender IO mod, that allows me to basically teleport from one floor to the next. Uh, but for now, what I'm thinking of doing is possibly knocking this out and making a second floor, and same with over here. Uh, so let's just do that here. Um, I don't have a uh, shovel, I just realized that. Is Tinkers in this? I think it is. Yeah, yeah, it must be, because I think I was working with it before. Yeah, it's already, it's all in here. So, I'm oh, going to do a diamond shovel for now. Um... Why would I just regular diamonds? Yes, I do. And I don't have any sticks. Fuck. All right. So. That. Don't know why I did that. Come on. There we go. All right. And do I have any? Catalyst. Uh, what touched? Unstable three. Oh god. Um no. Do I have the uh pet? Where's the pet at? I'm probably looking right at it, aren't I? Nope, it's right here. Uh so I'll put that down here for now and I need a book. Oh, there we go. Alright. Seven for this efficiency. Okay, I'll take that. Ed efficiency, okay. Well, not the best ones in the world, but it'll get the job done. So, I'm gonna dig down, maybe. Uh. Oh, fuck. I don't have the uh, spider on me. Huh. Oh, this poses a bit of an issue. Uh. Well, I'll, I'll start working on this here, empty this area out, and once we come back, I'll uh, make it so that it uh, looks nice and pretty. Alright, we're back. So, uh, basically, I have gotten this area all uh, all carved out. I'm just going to put in some walls first, and maybe some torches, or whatever I can find, honestly. Maybe I'll find a special lamp of some sorts uh, later on, because I know that the chisel mod's in here as well. Um, but for now, I basically right now I'm using up all my furnaces, gathering some stone that uh, so I can make some like stone bricks or something. Uh, I don't know why I didn't just wait until they all had eight. Uh, but yeah, I'm basically just uh, waiting for this stone to cook here. It'll take about uh, I don't know five or ten more minutes, and I also uh, got some ore as well down there. Um, now this the the reason why I got this was because I was testing out on this world a uh, the ore spawn mod. Uh, mainly because of the, like, the duplicator tree and things like that, because I, I know that there are, this world for some reason is lacking in resource, um, in terms of, like, ores and shit. I had to actually travel out significantly far, if I recall, like, all the way out here, just so that I can get some, like, diamonds and shit, so... Yeah, I don't have diamonds, like, I looked around here, there's not really that many diamonds left. I know you agree with me, um, but for now I'm gonna I'll, I'll deal with that I'll deal with the uh, the equivalent exchange in the next episode, uh, which will be down here. But I'm also gonna put the teleporters down there as well. Um, but in the meantime, I'm basically just cooking these up. 
Uh, this will take about five or so more minutes here just to get it all done. Um, I don't know the exact amount of time. I kind of stopped paying attention to that. Um, but yeah, I'm waiting for that all to do there thing. And I also forgot to mention that I did inc uh, include one more mod, um, which is just to basically to help me in the long run. It's called the Adventure Backpack Mod, which allows me to basically uh, create a backpack with a special effect or some sort of uh, um, style to it. Uh, now, first and foremost, what I'm probably going to do is just create the base backpack as I can't create many of the other backpacks and I don't know off the top of my head what uh, what backpack I would be looking for. But what I would be kind of hoping for is, because for when I last saw, it's still in beta, but where is it? Uh, Enderman, Obsidian, uh, it is right... Also, this one's fucking annoying. It's, or, wait, no, it's not that one. It's the, uh, there's one backpack in here that's really annoying. I just can't see it right now. There's, I wish there was a way to increase the icon size. Oh, there it is. Neon backpack. Or, uh, rainbow, I guess. Um, uh, dragon, there it is. I want to create this. Now, for some reason, I thought I'd included another star. But I do have an, uh, a dragon egg. It's right there. I know how to get it. So that's fine. Um, can I just... Backpack... Damn it, I can't. Okay. Um, Alright, so I need two... Uh, two ender pearls. Um, I think three obsidian, so I'll do that as well. Uh, do I have any ender pearls, though? That's the... Oh, I have a dragon egg right here. Okay. Oh, it must have been Lucky Blocks then. I might have not gone to the end yet. Um. Do I have any Ender Pearls? That's the question. I have. Okay, I do. Two Ender Pearls, um, Dragon Egg, and. I'll show you guys why in a sec. Oh, End Stone. I don't think I have any End Stone. We. So, seriously surprised if I do. Um, I guess I'll hold off on that part here, um, but basically what I'll need is that, the two, so one, two, three, four items, and I'm just missing the end stone, so I'll do that later, but right now I can make the base backpack, which is, uh, the tanks, which is iron and glass, and I have a shit ton of fucking iron in one of these chests, uh, iron and glass. Hmm. Where do I have the glass at? You're where I put the glass. Come on. I don't have any glass. Oh, I do. Okay. Uh, but I think I'm going to need a lot more than that, actually. Because I think I need... Let's go to the... Uh, uh, item? Oh, there it is. Uh, I need... One, two, three, four, six, seven per, and I need 14. I have six. So I'm gonna have to smelt some of this here. Um, I need more glass, anyways, because if I'm gonna be expanding the house later on, I'm um, gonna need to uh, do that. Uh, but I need that, that for those, and I'm gonna need four leather, a chest, and gold. Okay. Uh, how many gold? I just need the one gold, okay. Uh, one gold. I need a chest. This is a really, really... S oh my god, I have no wood. Trace, come here! Get over here! I love the Vein Miner so much. Like, it's one of the best mods ever. <laughs> It makes things so much easier. And on top of that, it still uses the hunger you would normally use. So that's a that's a guarantee. Uh, I'm just going to do here, here. Uh, I'll leave that there. 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 And there. And there. There we go. Uh, some of them will go into each other, but whatever. Do that, 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 
that, that, there we go. And if you hadn't noticed already, what I'm trying to do is just create a giant wall of tree around my house. So, like, I'm trying to make it so that there's, like, a giant wall of trees just hanging around my house. So that if I, like, I need to duck and weave, then I can. Um... Um, yeah, I'll just put you right here. Alright, I think I got enough wood right now. Um, yeah, haha, <laughs> you're also funny. Alright, so, I'm gonna create some logs here. I need to make some chests. I guess I could have kept some of the wood, but whatever. I'm gonna create some chests, because I might make more than one backpack later. Um, but I only need one chest right now, and I need wool. Um, I have wool, okay. So, what I need to do is, I need to go and make some carpet, and then, it's a simple recipe, do that, and you make the sleeping bag. There we go. So that's all good on that front, and now I'm just waiting for the glass, which I have. Alright, let's make this thing. I think I have enough resource. Yeah, I think so. Alright, two of those. Two of those. Alright, there we go. And if I remember it off the top of my head, I'm missing leather. But that's okay, because I'm going to go grab it here. Uh, if I have any leather. I didn't actually check. Shit. I have one piece of leather. Fuck. Fuck. Okay. Uh, looks like I'm gonna have to go and, uh, find some cows and kill some cows for some leather. So, uh, once I get the, uh, the preceding leather, because I'm not gonna do a montage of me just killing cows, uh, I will be right back. Alright, we're back. So, I actually noticed that, I remember that we had this horse, uh, horse area from when we, uh, opened up the lucky blocks. So, I'm just gonna kill all the horses. I am a cruel and ruthless being. Fear me. Ah. Yes, I have a top hat of uh, a turtle. But now I should have enough. I swear to God, I literally just slapped guys. Come on. Okay. So now I should have enough to uh, basically. Yeah, 33. Yeah. There's a lot of horses there. And I was like, you know what? I'm probably not going to find a cow. Let's do this. Now I know that there was a cow spawned when we did the locket blocks, and I didn't kill it, but I didn't find any regular cows on the way here. So, um. What am I doing? There we go. This is a lot easier. Okay, okay, come on. Well, nope. All right, so we'll head back, create the backpack, um, and with that, we'll also uh, go ahead and. I really want your hat. Um. Right. All right. Uh, with that, we'll also go ahead and um, oh Jesus! Didn't know why I did that. Um, I am blanking out so bad right now. Oh right, I will make the dragon backpack once we have the end stone. But for now, we'll uh, do this, and there we go. We have the uh, oh Jesus. Uh, I don't want that crap. God damn it. Alright, we'll just throw it down there then. Uh, we don't need that. No, no. No, no, no. No. Yes, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so. We have the backpack. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and throw some of this shit away here. Like this, this, this. That. Or, wait. I'm running out of space, guys. This is not a good thing. Alright, we'll throw that in here, and the stone looks like it's done, so I'm going to go ahead and do that as well. Um, now, there should be a suf ample amount of... Uh, yeah, I'm going to leave that there, fuck that. Um, there should be an ample amount of uh, resource for the actual room. Alright, oh, Jesus. 
this. All right, so now to go down here, I mean, I will create the dragon in the next episode. I just have to actually get the endstone for it. I'm pretty sure I've gotten rid of some of the endstone to be fair, uh, which was a bad idea. But I digress. Uh, so I've already had all this room carved out. I'll probably end up doing this. I might later on add some like little details, like mossy col or uh, mossy stone bricks and things like that. Just to make it look a little more dungeony. Um, but for now, we'll just do this because of the fact that it's clean, it looks good, and I also need to. Eh, eh, eh. I forgot to do that one. I think I'm going to need a lot more bricks, though, actually, now that I think about it. Because I don't technically have to fill out the corners, but. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna have to, uh, uh, whatever. Then I need a few more. No, no, maybe I, I might be good. I'm good. Uh, fuck. Right? Get. Fuck it. Come on. There we go. Alright, well, whatever. Let's do it this way. And then I'll, uh,. I'll probably put torches down for now, and then when I get some more glowstone or something, then I'll uh, work on that as well. Oh, fuck. Really? God damn it. Alright, so we'll get this all sorted out. And um, now I know I could have used the chisel to make this look a little different, I think. Maybe not. I don't know if the stone breaks, but... I could have made, made, like, made this look a little different, but this is going to be like a dungeon area anyways. Oh, I don't know what the hell happened there. Um, but with it being a dungeon and all, I'm going to also use a uh, this room as an equivalent exchange room on top of the... Uh, this one here. Uh, an equivalent exchange room on top of the teleporter room. Um, but this might be like the main hub area. Like the, like the main hub, it's like you drop down and, oh, okay, this is the room. Uh, I go over here for the teleporters, go over here for the equivalent exchange, etc., etc. So I might do that instead. Um, because this is a kind of tiny room, and the equivalent exchange itself alone takes up... Really? There we go. Uh, the equivalent exchange room takes up at least a good 5x5. Five five. Um, and this is... Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is seven by seven, roughly. So I want to at least... Okay, maybe seven by six. I at least want to make this like a hub room, and then when the time comes, then I will uh, go ahead and make uh, make it easier on myself, and also... Uh, oh, that's stone. Uh, that is stone. I almost had no... Uh, I didn't have enough. <sighs> Luckily I had some stone left. Alright, uh, yeah, this will probably be a main hub room, and then I'll be like, uh, teleporters to the left, etc, etc. Um, but for now, I'm gonna put some torches down here, so one here, one here. Um, one here, 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 and here. So, there's that. And for right now alone, I'm going to probably end up leaving this here for now. I'm not going to continue on with that. Uh, but I do thank you so much for watching. I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you leave a like, rating, and appreciate it. And in the next episode, we'll work on the equivalent exchange. And by the next episode, I should have some more area carved out as well as a ladder placed here for now. Um, but yeah, I will see you dudes in the next video. And... Uh Bye. Yeah. Yeah.